My name is Austin Webster. I'm a cinematographer here in Indianapolis, as well as the program manager for video, photo, and digital arts at the Indianapolis Art Center. And Roberts and Lumix were so kind as to let me use the GH6 for the past few weeks and tell you guys all about why I think this is the ultimate all-in-one filmmaking camera. Following up on their super successful GH5, Panasonic really decided to go all in on really capitalizing on the fact that their cameras have been used for independent filmmaking. And the GH6 really, really delivers on all these fronts, and I've been really, really impressed. I was actually able to pair it with my S5 to shoot a little fun cosplay video with my friend Rachel over this last weekend, and I was incredibly impressed by the features that this camera was able to pack in. One of them that really, really stands out to me is one that a lot of people might not think about because it's not a spec, but it has to do with the screen. Now, the real benefit with this is that you can actually still articulate this screen without bumping into your HDMI whenever you're plugging in a monitor or a Blackmagic Video Assist or Atmos Ninja. Another one of my favorite physical features of this camera is having the second record button right here on the left side of camera. That way, whenever I'm operating the camera and I can't reach either the shutter button or the other record button on top, I have another option that's a little closer to me. It's just really nice having the extra record buttons. But the best, the absolute best physical feature of this camera is implementing the lock system. I wanna make sure my exposure stays consistent across the board whenever I'm shooting. So having that lock feature is absolutely huge. Some of the best internal specs of this camera are the fact that it records ProRes internally to CF Express Type B or externally to an SSD. And of course, one of the biggest features is that the Panasonic GH6 goes up to 6K internally. Whereas on my S5 or on the S1, I have to go externally to my Blackmagic Video Assist to record 6K. I could do it internally here on the GH6. Now, I do find myself shooting in 4K more often. This is simply because of storage purposes and because I don't find myself needing to use all the data there from a 6K sensor. But if you're someone who shoots a lot of documentary or a lot of run and gun type stuff and you wanna be able to have that extra wiggle room to punch it in post, shooting 6K internally on this really makes this a great all-in-one body. It's incredibly versatile for documentary filmmaking, for narrative filmmaking, for all types of video purposes. It just makes me wanna pick it up and go shoot as it is. And that's what all cameras I think really should make you wanna do. So thank you Roberts and Lumix for giving me the GH6 to play for the past few weeks. I've absolutely loved my time with it and you guys are never gonna see this camera again.